back again in the corner of the garage. It's a cold one today, but uh, it's okay. I got the heater going. Totally worth it. Uh, and today I'm going to show you something that I've had in my possession for a couple weeks now. And it's just been kind of crazy with the holidays, but uh, I'm dying to get into it and show, you know, see all its capabilities. And, uh, well, here she is in all her glory. Got the Acmer P2. Uh, this is a machine I've had my eye on for a while. Uh, it's got a couple features that I thought were really attractive for the work I do. If you follow my work, you know, I'm all about like high precision, you know, making ultra detailed work and basically just getting as much out of your laser as you can. Uh, but one of the key features is uh, it's got these linear rails. Uh, and it's also got an automatic air assist, which I thought was really nice. So I cannot, cannot wait to check all that out and show y'all. Uh, make a bunch of projects. Um, so, yeah, let's get into this, baby. Definitely the best part. Uh, first impression was that was boxed pretty well. Seems, everything seems to be like it's going to be in order here. I've got my user manual. And you know, I, I, I thought I saw in the box that this thing was fully assembled, and it would appear that the entire system is fully assembled. I, I'm going to be able to pull this machine out and just check and make sure everything's snugged up, and it should be ready to run. I should be running this thing here in the next 20 minutes. But, uh, yep, definitely can't wait to open all this stuff up. So let's see what we got. Let's start with the, the most important part. Uh, you know, I'm terrible about it. Not going to lie. I, I always wear the glasses, but I'm definitely always looking at, at the lasers when they're running because uh, I'm worried about the detail. But you definitely, with the glasses, you shouldn't be looking at the laser. But if you're going to look at the laser, we're going to be near it while it's working. Definitely want to wear the glasses. Here we got our air assist. So this plugs into the the system. Nice air pump. Let's see if we can get you see here. Yep, you plug it into the system. It's automatic. Nice material package. Cut it open. Oop, didn't get it. There we go. Nice bunch of materials. Definitely use these. Look at that. Wow. Well, that's definitely a lot of materials to get you started. I love this. They sent you a test card so you can see. This will definitely help you get going quick, give you an idea of where to start. If you're cutting the same wood that you're looking at here, and it appears to be the same wood that came in this material kit. So uh, kudos to Akmer. This is awesome. Really nice, very impressed. Love it, the module. Go one at a time. Module. Let's open this up together. Nice. Fully sealed. Can I 
see there. All one unit. Nice wide slot to grab onto. Got the focus lever, which we'll check that. And uh, this is all one unit, so you know, maybe maybe an issue for clearance. You know, I usually take usually they have a shield, and I take this off, and this is exposed. But uh, I do a lot of flat surfaces, so probably won't be an issue for what I got going on. Do uh, let's do this one next because this has been bugging me. Oh, little toolkit. That's cool. Got a little spanner wrench, Allen wrenches. Got a zip tie. Accessory package. Power cable. Yeah, obviously need this. Love it with the blue ice USB communication cable. Goods. Looks like uh, I don't know if there's an extra cable or what. Got a key. Got the SD card. And the thumb drive for the SD card. Yep. That's everything we need. Uh, it looks like the air pump tubing. So I, I was wondering about the tubing for my... The air assist and it looks like it's part of the unit there. Just move a couple pieces of foam. Bam. It's exposed. This thing is cool. Definitely packaged nicely, nice and snug, which is what you want. Yep. Snug. All right, we'll put it up so we can look at it. And here she is in all her glory. Popped it right out, set it on the table here. Exactly how it came out of the box. Uh, assuming everything goes together and powers on, I'm just more and more impressed. You know, moving it, it feels about right. Let's see the linear bearings. Ooh, that's what I'm most excited about. I like how they have their belts on a loop here. It's kind of nice. So we've got dip switch. Maybe for the rotary. Rotary. Uh, for the air assist. Looks like there's your main power. That's the USB to the computer. This plugs into the air assist. Which, hold on. There she is. So you just plug that tube into the front there. Then for this, I had to do some digging, but it plugs into the bottom, so you can see down there with our Wi-Fi antenna. So it has Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi confirmed. Uh, something I thought was cool for the module. It's got this like five-pin cable. 
Nice, a little bit more rigid than that standard flat white connector that we're used to seeing. Yeah, I'm gonna put that on right now, actually. We got the module, and on these little guides right here, they slide into it, into this channel. Oop. This, and then on the opposite side, there's a knurled knob. in which you turn to tighten it. Now, there, it has a plug in it. Pop that out, plug this in. Now this guy's got a notch in it. You wanna make sure it lines up with the notch that's on the uh, female portion of the connector. You just push that in there. And there she is, Acma P2. This is the 10 watt model, and I, I cannot, I cannot wait to make some creations and show you guys how it works. So, thanks again for watching. Make sure you like, follow, subscribe. Uh, find me on Facebook. I've got a group dedicated to laser engraving, laser engraving tips and tricks, free imager files. I share my work there. Uh, if you follow, if you want to follow my artwork, laser, laserpicks.com. That's laser-picks.com. It's one of the largest archives of free laser ready images. Um, and until next time, I'm gonna make some cool stuff.